Hey guys, it's Nails by Dage. Welcome to my channel. The design I'm going to be doing in the video is going to be a short fringe set. I'm not going to be talking during the whole video, but I'll explain the steps that I'm doing and the products that I'm using. I'm going to put it in the description box below um, it, with the links too as well. So right now I'm using my sanding bit to take the shine off the nails. Um, this helps with preventing any lifting. Usually people use um, their nail file too to take the shine off, so you could do either or. So right here, I'm using one of my cuticle bits. Um, I just use this to go around the cuticles to make sure I'm getting the shine and to make sure I'm getting any of the dead skin. Hey you guys, so basically what I'm doing right now, I'm just putting the tips on. I get the tips and the glue from Amazon as of right now, but I'll put the link and the name of the products in the description box below. So after this, I just usually just cut and shape um, to whatever the client wants. So that's what I'll be doing after this.
Hey guys, so during the shaving part, I prefer to use scissors and nail clippers to get the shape that I want because, I don't know, for me, I just feel like it's easier, but, you know, you could do whatever works for you. Okay, so what I'm doing now, I'm using my sanding bit to blend the natural nail and the tip together. And I'm also using my sanding bit to take the shine off of the tip to help with a smoother application. Okay, so after shaping and everything, I use my favorite primer, Young Nails. I usually put on two coats and I put it on the natural nail, but um, I don't really see a difference with putting on one or two coats, but I just feel more comfortable putting on two coats. So after I use the primer, that's when I start my application.
Hey you guys, so after I finish the first part of my French, I take my file and I start shaping it to make the shape more sharp.
Hey guys, so every time I'm doing French after application, I use this bit and I take the extra acrylic off and then I will also to use it to seal the cuticles.